Good morning, Mom. I'm Dr. E.K. with Anesthesia. It's very nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. My name is Michelle. I'll be the nurse in the room with your daughter today. Great. We just need to confirm a couple things, her name and date of birth and some paperwork, okay? Okay. Let me check her band here. Can you tell me her name and date of birth? Her name is Bella Austin, and her date of birth is uh, April 24, 2011. All right, and Dr. E.K., her medical record number? Her medical record number is 123456. All right, thank you. That's correct here. There's no site marking that is needed. Our anesthesia and surgery consents are complete and properly witnessed. Our pre-op worksheet is complete. Mom, could you please tell me her weight? 25 pounds. Okay. That's 11.3 kilograms. Allergic to any foods or medications? No, she has no allergies. All right, and that's confirmed with our band here also. There are no blood products that are needed in the room? No. I uh, want to confirm with you the safety checklist is complete? The safety checklist has been completed. Okay. Mom, when was the last time she had anything to eat or drink? 6 p.m. yesterday evening. Okay, she is properly NPO. Dr. E.K., do we anticipate any critical events? I do not anticipate any critical events. Is there a difficult airway? She will not be a difficult airway. Okay. And aspiration risk? Her aspiration risk is zero. Okay. And our plan for extubation? I do plan to extubate and then go to the PACU followed by the floor. Okay. What antibiotics are we going to be using? We're going to give Cefoxetin 40 milligrams per kilogram based on a weight of 11.3 kilograms. Okay. And we are going to be supine. Her virus score is a two, mm -hmm. and her plan is to um, have saline on the field. It is a two for the alcohol prep, and then the cautery and light cords that we're going to be using. Understood. Okay. This concludes our uh, pre-induction checklist. We're ready to head back. Okay. Questions? All right, all quiet. Let's get started with our timeout. Start with introductions, head of the bed. EK, anesthesia attending. Jean, anesthesia resident. Akemi, surgery attending. Emma, surgery resident. Angelita, scrub. Michelle, circular. This is patient. Bella Austin, and we are doing a laparoscopic appendectomy. No site marking is needed. Her weight is 11.3 kilograms. She has no known allergies. We have no blood products in the room. She is supine with positioning check in four hours. Anesthesia, any concerns? There was a brief episode of desaturation into the 80s, but after mass ventilation and deepening the anesthetic, we improved. Okay, and the prophylactic antibiotic that was used? We gave Cefoxidin 40 milligrams per kilogram, which was 452 milligrams. What time was that given? It was given at 9.45 a.m. All right, it's been more than 10 minutes. The next dose is due? The next dose is due in four hours, which will be at 13.45. All right. Our fire risk score is a two, and it's, uh, the plan is for having the saline on the field, and it's for our alcohol prep and our cautery and light cords. Dr. E.K., post-op plan? The post-op plan is to extubate and go to the PACU, followed by the floor. All right. Dr. Kawaguchi, any anticipated critical events? There's always the chance that the appendix may be perforated. We may need a suction irrigator or drains in the room. We have those in the room already. A any anticipated blood loss? Uh, three to five milliliters. Okay. Anticipated case duration? Uh, approximately an hour. Okay. Relevant images? The patient had ultrasound which showed appendicitis and then is up on the screen over there. Okay. It is up. Our on-field medication is quarter percent bupivacaine without any epinephrine. What is the max dose? Uh, the maximum dose would be 11 milliliters as she weighs 11.3 kilograms. Thank you. And the surgery post-op plan? The plan is for pack you to the, and then back up to the floor. Okay, thank you. Angelita, do we have all of our equipment in the room? Yes. So no implants, correct? No. Sterling ind indicators have been checked? Yes. Safe zone? It's, the safe zone is located between the surgeon and my mayo. Okay. And fluids on the field, we have the saline? Yes. Any other concerns, questions? No. All right. You may begin. Make the end please. All right. Let's debrief. 
Dr. Kawaguchi, the procedure in sight. We did a laparoscopic appendectomy for perforated appendicitis. Our specimen is labeled as an appendix. That's correct. Estimated blood loss? Five milliliters. No transfusions, correct? Correct. Correct. Wound class? It's a dirty wound as it's a perforated appendix. Okay. Our counts were complete and correct. Were there any equipment problems? No. Anesthesia, did you have any concerns or critical events? No. Is our post-op plan still the same? Plan is still to extubate and go to the PACU followed by the floor. Okay. Surgery, did you have any concerns or critical events? No. And post-op plan still the same? Same as a PACU and back to the floor. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome.